Welcome to the newsroom of Streamline News Headquarters Turbet, Baluchistan. Good morning. Well, this is Thomas Walton. Today, it is Sunday 11th of April 2021. Well the news of this morning is about the eruption of St. Vincent's Volcano Mountain on the Caribbean. The erupted volcano emitted dust, ash, smoke and lava. The volcano was unfunctional since 1979, it seemed that the volcano was getting active in December, which erupted this week. Dust, smoke, and ash rising into space as Le Sofriere volcano erupted at the eastern Caribbean island. However, the eruption occurred in the island on Friday. Ash, smoke, and dust rose up to 6 kilometers high, and the ash was headed east into the Atlantic Ocean. Evacuees moved on a farmer's trucks they depart from the village of Rose Hall from the affected area. It was reported that huge ash and dust fall in the vicinity area around the volcano. In an interview Ursula Joseph, said that more eruption could occur. Well let's watch the footage of volcano. Evacuation orders have been issued when a volcano erupted on the Caribbean island of St Vincent. Around 4,500 residents near the volcano have left their homes. They've been given temporary accommodation on cruise ships and other parts of the island. Heavy falls of ash have stopped some evacuation efforts. It's been more than 40 years since the volcano erupted, costing almost $100 million in damage. Authorities predict it could be up to four months before evacuees can return home. Further, she said that it is not possible to foresee the weather they may be greater or smaller. People around the volcano have started moving towards the safe shelter. They carried backpacks, duffel bags, shopping bags, personal belongings and other necessary tools. Many people stayed in their home, meanwhile some others were trying to board cruise ships and manage other means in order to move to neighboring island, they offered them assistance. Last time the volcano erupted on the 13th of April 1979. And an earlier eruption occurred in 1902 which killed about 1600 people. The government has provided necessary evacuation orders on Thursday. For nearly more 15,000 people, who live in the erupted area. It is said that approximately 4,500 people near the volcano have been moved safely through vehicles and ships. That's the news of today from Streamline News Team. Hope everyone is in a good condition. This is Thomas Walton. Have a good day.